how's everyone doing today? No gym for me today. Um, it's an off day. That's why I don't have the gym today. And I probably won't have the gym tomorrow. I just kind of have to see, um, play it by ear. Because tomorrow I have the x-ray at noon and the doctor's appointment at 1.30ish. It's right after the x-ray. Anyway, go see what's going on with my back. Get everything checked out. Make sure I'm okay. Uh, see how long I need to rehab. If I need to rehab. I'm pretty sure I'm going to need to rehab. Uh, see what I can do to make it not hurt. It's weird. It's it's just a dull pain the entire time. I'm not really sure what's going on. That's what's going on there. Not too much, really. A few more followers on Twitter. I really appreciate you know, everyone following me on there who is following me on there. Um, also, all the followers on Facebook and all that that have been supporting my videos, I really appreciate that. Um, I do really, really like making these YouTube videos. I like putting information out there, uh, especially when it comes to having a family and going to the gym, being healthy, you know, the day-to-day -day that you have to deal with, also the types of family fun you can do on a budget because we're definitely on a budget <laughs> um, everybody should be on a budget but uh, almost to the wife's work to have lunch I forgot what we're having today so we'll see and I'll let you guys know what it is if I remember to take my camera in with me yeah not to mention, I don't know when I'm going to get this video edited up because my computer's acting stupid again. So hopefully I can get it up for you soon. Because it's really, really starting to tick me off. <laughs> this is what I have for lunch today. <laughs> Stack of <laughs> celery sticks. That. <laughs> Valentine hot sauce. <laughs> and protein powder shake. Mm. Alright, so lunch is over. As you can see, the most of our lunches are pretty simple. Uh, we are flexible dieters, or I'm a flexible dieter. My wife and her sister are on a, uh, a more strict diet, I guess, right now. I find it a lot easier, even though I am a flexible dieter, to, to pre-make your meals. Uh, that way you have something on lunch. It's already made. You're not tempted to go out and buy something at a fast food restaurant to try to make it fit or to worry about what's going to fit later on. You know, it just makes it just makes it easier and it's cheaper. So it's a lot cheaper just prepping and pre-making chicken and stuff. I mean, that meal there probably cost maybe a dollar or something. I don't, I don't know exactly, but it's very, very small compared to how much you would spend going out to eat. That's kind of what we do. Anywho, I'm on my way back to work. It's on lunch. It's actually <clears throat> looking into getting a uh, a new desk for for the room, my room to uh, kind of set up there by where I film and stuff at. Not really sure exactly what I want yet. We'll uh, kind of research a little bit more. I do have some things in my Amazon wish list that. Hopefully, you know, I'll be able to see something like that. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. Got to come up with the funds first. Almost back to work now. All right, so Cameron got his first Amazon package today. It's your first one, right? Your very first one. No. No. no? This is actually my second. Remember the baby wheels? Oh, that didn't count. That was for your birthday. We bought that. This is your first package. You picked all this stuff out. Okay. So, go ahead and open it. Let's see what it is. You cut it. Don't stab through it. You don't want to stab through it. Cut it. Like, what do you, you use? Just like you use scissors. There you go. I want to see it. Daddy, can Careful. I see it? Cool. Okay, after much cutting, it took us a little while to get into this one. Let's see what he got. What is it? What is it? What do we got there? Boba Fett. Boba Fett. This is what Cameron's being for Halloween. He's going to be Boba Fett for Halloween. Oh, awesome. Oh, Pretty wow. cool for his first Amazon, first Amazon package. There you go. She popped it. 
Alright, so as you can see, the gown, I need x-rays done, find out about the knee and the back. See how everything goes, fixing to get the x-rays now for the chiropractor on the CD. And then I'll head up to the sports doctor, see what he says, see if he'll let me record some stuff, we'll find out. Alright, so just got out of the doctor, and awesome news, I am so, just so ecstatic. So, good news, nothing wrong with any of my discs, any of my bones, nothing, everything checked out fine according to the x-ray. Um, everything looked good, he said that the only thing it would be, would be muscles in my back, which basically, I more or less overdid it a little bit in the gym, so... Back the weight down a little bit once my back is fully healed and it's not hurting anymore just to make sure that everything's okay but all my bones and everything look great so I am super excited. The second part of this whole thing is is the doctor was amazing. He was so cool. Um, he was able to explain to me everything that had happened or that he thought was happening, different ways to rehabilitate it. He's not a chiropractor. I don't know if he has any chiropractic background I'm not real sure but anyway he was able to uh, realign my hips which my hips are kind of a problem apparently so I guess I definitely need to work on mobility mobility is definitely gonna have to become a must <laughs> but aside from that if you guys do live in the st. Louis area his name is Brian McAfee also I found out that he is the st. Louis Cardinals team physician so Obviously, he knows his stuff because he's, you know, a physician of a pretty huge sports team. Uh, so, yeah, he was awesome, though. I mean, not, not because he gave me good news. That was awesome. But because he was just, he was patient with me. He, you know, he explained everything thoroughly to me. It was just, it was... It was awesome. It was just, it was a really good experience, uh, both because I got good news and because he was just a good physician. He was just, he was, he was really awesome. So I highly recommend him. Uh, I'll definitely be going back to see him if there are any issues that follow that. So anyway, me and the wife are going to Duncan. So we're here fixing to get some coffee, celebratory coffee. Since my back's not jacked up. <laughs> Oh. Alright, so we got some we got blueberry right coffee, iced coffee. It's so got turkey sausage on it. It's My wife right got... Egg white. What'd you get again? Caramel? Oh, shit. What'd you get again? Oh, no. I can't eat this because it's not the same macros. It's butternut. But, no, yours. Pumpkin spice. Pumpkin spice. She's gonna hate me. <laughs> Amanda got the wrong order or whatever she got. <laughs> I got some... Butternut donut. This thing looks amazing. I'm only gonna eat half of it because Megan's got the other half. It's so good. Cool story of something I just found out about the blueberry is it's not sugared like caramel and all that stuff. It's actual concentrate, so there's no sugar in it. I did not know that, so it's actually somewhat better for you. So it's not as bad for you as normal coffee. And it tastes pretty good, but I had to get apparently a large squirt in my medium no I had a medium and a large squirt in my in my medium so it would taste like blueberry more yeah anyway I'm gonna drink this down and I gotta go pick up my daughter all right so like I said I got off work a little bit earlier today here I took the Addy girl out for a surprise she doesn't even know what it is now, I'm not gonna tell you what it is either until we get in there are you ready to go in yeah see what the surprise is Yes! Alright, let's do it! Alright, so this place is like an old candy place. It's got a bunch of candies. And I'm gonna let Addie get some candies. She's really excited. <laughs> show you what we get. Alright, so we just got out of the uh, Ben Franklin's Crafts. And like I said, it's a bunch of candy. It's like an old, old time candy store where you choose your candy and they weigh it out and all that fun stuff. So, it was pretty awesome. I spent more in there than what I thought I was going to spend, for sure. Uh, but Adeline got about a half a pound of jelly beans, a box of candy. Uh, I got Cameron some gum. My son some gum, because apparently he's allowed to chew gum in class at school. He's never allowed to do that. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> and I got Megan some things. 
it's really gonna make her mad because she's dieting. <laughs> so she has to save and eat them on the weekend. But I got everybody's stuff. Um, spent 11.06. Definitely was not a lot, not planning on spending that much. But Adeline had fun. Did you get everything you wanted, Sissy? Uh huh. Yeah. I'll show the camera. Okay, show the camera. Okay. Hurry. Oh, jelly beans, and what are those things called? Jube, jujubes? Ju, jujubes? I don't know, jujubes? Anyway, so now we're gonna head off to the park and just play at the park for a little bit until her mom gets off from work. And then we got Cameron's music recital tonight. So that should be fun. So after much debate today, we decided to come into Culver's and have some dinner because tonight is, what is it called again, buddy? Blevins Night Out. Yeah, Blevins Night Out. It's called Blevins Night Out, so it was my son's uh, school's night out thing that he's got going on. So part of the uh, our order goes to his school, like a donation sort of. So anyway, I'm gonna eat some foods. I got some buffalo chicken strips. I've been trying to keep my calories. Well, not really wash them, but I've been trying to keep it a little lower because I've been able to make it into the gym because my back. But like I said earlier, the doctor said it was good news, so I'll probably take the rest of this week off and then start it up again next week. That way my back just has time to completely heal and I don't rip or tear or anything in the process. So, yep, get our food and have some meat. It's my chicken strips. I had four. I already ate one and a half. Megan got that delicious looking burger. Is this mine? Hey, this yeah. is Cameron! <laughs> <laughs> Kids got their little meals, they get free ice cream. You can get live cream. Amanda got a burger too. Oh. Only one that got chicken. I guess everybody else is tired of the chicken but me. <laughs> Alright, so we're sitting here waiting for Cameron's musical to start. As you can see, there's a bunch of people. Tons and tons. But I'll get some recording of his stuff whenever it actually comes up, so we'll get catch that. But I won't record the whole thing because that'll get really boring for everybody. things in the mail tonight after we got home from Cameron's recital thing, musical thing, whatever you want to call it. Anyway, here's what we got. My protein, whey protein. Of course everybody's seen this on the internet from popular people that are on there as far as like Chelsea Lifts and Michael Corey, a bunch of people, Humorous Fitness, a bunch of people. Anyway, these are the flavors we got. Lemon cheesecake and chocolate coconut so I will definitely get a review up for everyone to see how you know how they taste how they mix up everything let you guys know stay tuned <laughs> 